some hey what's up guys it's Lego Reaper here and we're back with some more Horizon Zero Dawn um, last time that we left off we tried um, to complete a Chris challenge and the hunting ground uh, which were both complete disasters uh, still only have uh, the silver medal on both of these challenge um, I'll well I have upgraded the um, the weapons, the unique weapons like the storm, uh, the ice rail, and storm slinger, and all that. But I still need to upgrade the, the the carry capacity for this one with a rat skin. But like I I didn't I haven't tried um, the trial um, with this improved storm slinger, so I could try it, but not now. Um, as far as the Icarus challenge, uh, there's nothing really much I can do except uh, get better and probably have a bigger uh, medicine pouch because last time I didn't have any healing and it kind of fucked up some stuff. So, but for now we're gonna These are helpful. do this quest. I don't better know if go. it's the last one of the DLC, but we'll see. Well, it's definitely towards the end, but we'll see what happens. And I have a feeling I'm gonna encounter uh, the last machine uh, that I haven't encountered yet. Where is she, Oria? Oh, there she is. What are we supposed to do here? Eloy, this is it. My chance to reunite with the spirit and perhaps to reunite her with the blue light. It's not a chance I would have had alone. I needed an outsider, someone ignorant of our ways, but no, not ignorant. I. Are you trying to thank me, Aurea? Yes, of course. That's what you do. Untangle knots. Create possibilities. Thank you for making this pilgrimage possible. I only wish it had not been necessary to humiliate Aratok. You were wise to let him come. He's earned the right, stubborn as stone, but he's had to be. The war demanded it. And so have I. Aratok told me you were a captive of the Karja for a long time. It sounded bad. For Aratok, it all comes back to that. He thinks the Karja changed me. They did not. They merely sharpened my focus. When all else is lost, you think about what's truly important. The spirit. The blue light. The beyond. <sighs> and my brother, too. Every time I felt the chill northern wind, I thought of him. Worried for him. What did the war do to Aratok? He cut away everything until only his true self remained. Unyielding ice. No but no has more sheer will. He fought the Karja for a thousand freezing nights, yet always rallied his hunters at sunrise. It is said he endured 23 wounds in those years. His hunters counted them. He never complains of one. Instead, he complains that life with me is harder. He's right. What have I ever given him but struggle? Now that I'm chieftain of the Werak, I don't suppose I can order you to tell me about silence? Aratok would never have presumed to grasp for a secret of the Conclave. But you are not Aratok, and if you have dealt with silence, your need is well apparent. Silence came to Ban Ur from the distant north, a young shaman of the Owl's Watch, a remote Warrick that rarely comes south to parley. Silence was a shaman. It was. Or at least, when we sent runners to ask the Owl's Watch, they said he was. His knowledge of the machines was beyond compare, and he was hungry to trade what he knew to the rest of us. 
Didn't take him long to gain the trust of the Conclave, and eventually, an invitation to attend. What about you? Did you trust him? No. But he impressed me. He carried himself with poise and authority. I wanted to learn from him, but that was not to be. He was granted knowledge of our most sacred meeting place, the frozen caves of the Malmstrom, a month's march from Banur. He met with us there, as is custom at high winter. But when we next returned, the caves had been looted. Relics of the old world stolen. Holes cut in ice and metal. Yeah, that'd be silence, all right. He vanished with the spoils. We sent our best trackers after him. None returned. And when we checked back with the Owl's Watch, those who had vouched for him were gone. As though he never existed. Some in the Conclave began to doubt he was even Banuk to begin with. And what do you think? He committed an unforgivable sacrilege. He's unscrupulous and dangerous. But also brilliant, skilled, and knowledgeable without equal. Except, perhaps, for you. Anyone else I would warn off but you may be able to treat with him safely. Just don't lower your guard. I'll keep that in mind, Horea. Thanks. What are we gonna find up there, Horea? Ruins. Machines. And a door, like that of a cauldron. I have faith that you can find a way through it, Aloy. For beyond it lies the spirit. I know I can find her there. Though I do not doubt the daemon has tried to hide the way. It hasn't been easy for you, Aurea. Getting back to this point. It was all to hear her voice again. This time, we both will. I'd like that. Are you ready then? Once we ascend, it will be hard to turn back. Finally, we ascend. How? I don't see a way up. Not up. Through. Now, brother! You can call upon the power of the old ones. What was this place? The spirit once told me that this all used to be part of its domain. A fortress that defended humankind from a terrible danger. A fortress? It looks more like a machine. Is that not fitting? blue light often dwells in machines. Let's just hope that some remains here. I don't think you, um... I don't think your, uh... Your chant or dance or whatever opened that door. I think it was more, uh, the smoke and the fire and all that. Whatever. But this is impressive, though. 
there anything? No. Oh, 36% medicine pouch. That's what I like to see. Not sure. Kenny's homecoming. Okay. Uh. Can you follow me here? Can I kill you from above here? Oh, I can. I should probably. Oh, I already have the stealth outfit. Lol. So, mellow packs and watchers. That's it. That's not that bad, I think. I hope they're not gonna shoot at everything just because they're here. Can you let me do this stealthy a little bit? There. Nothing happened, Bellowback. They're in the bush with me, hey guys! <laughs> yeah, Bellow back, nothing happened, just go on your business. What do you think I'm doing? I think I can. At least they don't see uh they don't see them. Uh, but well I don't get spotted spotted because of them. Okay. What is what are you doing, Watcher? What are you even looking at? Okay. That kiss. Whoop, it's not the right one. Okay. No room. Well, I guess I could do that. They're, they're shooting Storm Slinger, wow. Okay. We must climb higher on a path will cut here. Yeah, yeah. The chieftain's pace is measured in hours. Are you 
you referring to me, uh, our attack? Because my pace is perfect. I need medicine, not, not your fire root. These will keep. We can make our way. Yes. This way. <laughs> this is the way. Uh, where does this lead? Ah, oh, okay. Don't think there is any use going that way, so just go up, as she said. Not much farther now. Last we were here, we fought our way through there. The machines overcame us. We retreated, dropping supplies and taking losses. <laughs> now we must prevail, with only two warriors and a shaman to protect. Aloy is no ordinary warrior. And I can hold my own. Even so, we could go that way instead. There are machines up there, but also cover. We could stay hidden, at least for a while. All right, I get the options. Now follow my lead. Well, I guess I could go to Seltway. To be honest, all the dead bodies didn't look inviting, so... Let's use the smart way. I went this way years ago. Looking for cover in case machines came prowling. I have no doubt that it is guarded now, but we may be able to stay hidden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if it turns out bad, well. Not all the rest can be seen oh my god, stalkers on. Oh, no. I don't think I can one shot stalkers with uh, my. Silent strike. I don't think I can kill stalkers. Wait, there's another one just here. I see you in the snow. Well... Am I trapped here? Interesting. So there's a stalker there. Like, if only I could one shot. That's your stealth, you... I thought it was the easy way up. I'm not gonna kill you. Just for fun. There's a data point, dude. Why? Oh, it's up there. I 
can you go up Aloy? She doesn't want to go up. Okay, what's the point of this? Okay, now you want to go. Why aren't we moving? Shut up, I just wanted to take that, okay? Be wary of mine. Do I try to kill them? I'm literally right there, right? That would be a little bit risky, to be honest. Fuck it, this. There's a door. Whatever. Oh my god, wow. A lot of supplies. What's here? Am I even going the right way? Oh, that's the... Oh, that's the way... Um, that's Arthag's way, I guess. Ah, okay. A lot of stuff here. Is this projector? Maybe to show holograms without a focus. Let's see if I can restore power. Holo Redux. Okay. Aratak Area, you might see shapes drawn from light. Don't be alarmed. Thank you. For being here, everyone. I suppose it's not every day you get to have cocktails inside an active volcano, right? <laughs> Unless you're George, and I can hardly blame him for drinking on the job. <laughs> None of this would be here without our beloved director, Penny Chow. So, here's to you, Penny. Put a cork in the Yellowstone Caldera. <laughs> I'd say you deserve a margarita. Grab <laughs> your glasses, everyone. I'd love to add something. This effort wouldn't have been possible without our lead programmer. Thank you, Anita, for bringing us our real mastermind, Cyan. I'll second that, Director Chow. All right, Cyan. What's our latest number? The current count is 1,654. <laughs> <laughs> well, then drink up, everyone. Here's to 1,654 more years without an eruption. <laughs> it was the spirit. The old ones. I could only grasp some of what they said. 
You were right, Aria. This place was built to stop something terrible. And it worked. As for the spirit, I'm starting to get an idea of what it could be. It's an AI. We'll have to go through a lot of machines to get to that door. More than the wear I could prevail against before. Aloy will see us through. Onward then. Our challenge awaits. The geothermal plant can be suspended. The cooling system masked. Massive challenges solved. So I must endure this on the next part. All I need to do is install a mysterious software. Conversation. It's not what I would be. Okay, so I'm supposed to kill everything here? Yeah, kill machines around the cauldron door. Okay. Wow, really? they do I guess um, do you resist freeze I think you resist yep you resist freeze I think fire is good again well I guess she's gonna freeze it yeah Honest, they're more useful than I give them credit for. Because I couldn't freeze that thing. And she did like she did really fast. Yep. I don't think anyone has been uh, that far here. What's that door though? This is huge as fuck. Wow, the mushrooms are the best. 36%. Full already. Okay, I need to hold it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wait, wait, wait. A thunder jaw? Where is it? Oh! Hi, friend! Oh my god! I did a lot of damage. The brain. K damage that was fucking great. Songs and deeds, but that battle was a verse worth singing. Now, Aloy, fucking wrecked it, man. Can you open it? Oh, yeah, I can't do anything you Let's want. Out. Did you see what I just did? I fucking wrecked that thunder jaw. I can't do anything.
Years have passed since I stood here. Since then, the daemon has... ...taken over. It's like an infection. Attacking all this machinery. Everything has changed. It's twisted. The path I took to get to the spirits... ...lost to us. We'll find a new path, Araya. I promise. All right. Let's go. Yes. And finish this. Oh! Complete. That was complete. Okay. Blue Gleam. So I could just leave? <laughs> my, my quest is done here. Oh, we're in a cauldron, actually. The Forge of Winter. Yeah, sure. Right. There's no going back now. 